Yes, sir. That's right. Yeah. That's right. <laughs> your boy has turned 19. Today is your boy's birthday. We feeling good. We feeling noise. See while other people take the day off. You know what I'm saying? From their jobs. And they, they don't really go and take a day. No, we're here every day grinding. Hit that subscribe button. Today's artist of the day, Amber, your rose. Hello, everybody. How are we all doing? And as you can tell by the intro, yes, it is my birthday. Uh, go ahead. Get all the old jokes out the way. I'll wait. All right. Yeah. I am turning 19. So all those jokes you just made of, oh, I've turned 45. Fuck you. Okay. Eat shit. I'm only 19. Cheers, lads. This is water. I don't drink on the job. Wrapping up uh, these last few CEs to review, at least uh, the ones that have music. Um, we're here with Amber Your Rose, who, fun fact, I actually saw, um, I, didn't, I actually haven't met her. I've seen her in passing a lot. And, but I saw her music actually not from NSEG, from the MTM management meeting, uh, which is the music label separate from NSEG uh, at Georgia State University. And uh, she played a song, I forgot, it was a play on her name, I forgot the name of it. But yeah, she plays that. Also, it's been all over my Instagram uh, playing the, uh, is it, it's not the violin, it's violin or viola, it's one of those two. I'm drawing a blank right now, I'm really tired. And her music intrigued me, she was already on my list to review, but when I saw she was on the list of like the top 25 and the CEs, you know, I had your boy had to like, all right, we're gonna bump you up on the list, make some shit shake. In terms of gifts so far, I got the new iPhone 15 Pro. I didn't, no one bought this, I mean, they bought it. My grandmother has a, has been loyal to the to the network that she's with. Shout out to my, to my, to Letha. Thank you guys, thank you so much, love you. And yeah, I was able to get this for like essentially free because she's been like loyal for like th three decades now. <laughs> so yeah, the for the other gift I got is the iPhone, which I'm loving. Uh, you know, it, it has really nice quality. And I'm not seeing the two difference, but we're not here for that. Amber Euros. I'm not seeing a description down here to read per se, but you know, for those of you new to the channel, what we do here in this lovely space with you beautiful people watching. We take an artist, uh, listen, an upcoming artist from anywhere on planet or galactic, if there's any aliens out there making music, you know, hit your boy up, I got you. Go ahead, listen to three to five songs from them, Talk about what we like, what we don't like. And then at the end, we give them a rating. Talk about my opinion on them as a whole. Uh, and yeah, go from there. I'll leave a link to Amber Your Rose's music uh, and socials down below. If you guys want to go check out any of the songs you listen to in their entirety. Um, and yeah, and just go give her a follow because she's super talented. For my, for my birthday, as it is your boy's birthday, please subscribe. Subscribe. Let's grow, grow the channel, man. Really help your boy out. Uh, also... Um, another big thing you can do, my new song, Not A Word, that I've been promoting since September 1st. Please stream that on all platforms. Please, please, please. That is my, really my biggest thing I want my birthday, actually, is to eventually get that to a thousand. If we can get that to a thousand, it's on all platforms, specifically on Spotify. It's at 468 right now. If we can get that to a thousand, that would be tremendous. Thank you guys for the support you've been giving me already. Please keep subscribing to the channel. Road to a thousand subscribers here. Road to a thousand streams on there. More music will be coming out very, very soon. First track we'll listen to is titled The Bad Guy. Okay. That's a fact. Why would I not look up to you if you're not God? It's a bar. That's our bar. What? What are these bars? <laughs> so. Okay, like she does sound like half asleep, low key. She gotta be faded, and that has to be a freestyle, surely. 
like shortly. Even how that ended was very like freestyle esque. So I'm off the top or out the gate, uh, solid solid start. While she does sound sleepy and faded, that is I assume the point. Um, and you know she has good personality. She plays with her inflections good. The beats all right. Um, kind of a drunken all around kind of mess, but like in the most semi-organized way possible if that even makes any sense next track is titled gsu hoes let's let's see what's going on with the the hoes at, at, at our school this might be hard wait a minute oh my god okay young boy let's go man oh that was stoner i ate pizza on the way See, this is <laughs> your boy gets the references, you know what I'm saying? We know where that at. She's talking about the racetrack, the Stoner's Pizza, where homies get shot at, off the gat, dressed in all black in an all round Cadillac. Wait, that's rock! She is on her young boy. He really rap, she rapping like Nardo, she really is rapping like Nardo. <laughs> Shake some, shake some. I know we do shake some. That's hard. <laughs> oh shit! Might be song of the year, bro. <laughs> Yo, she just outed like. Three fourths of the no. First of all, she outed out every single. <laughs> oh God! Say it with me for the birthday time. That's going on the playlist. Oh my God! First of all, the, can we shout out the references before? Let's get toxic. Let's get negative. Let's get messy. Yeah. Let's get. Let's get. First of all, you know we love the references. You know, sto they get they still they at the racetrack. You know what I'm saying? I'll be eating stoner getting stone eating pizza on the way back. Stoner's pizza. See y'all not real Atlanta for real. And then out the gate, just out at every girl in every single door. <laughs> he said, "I stay at North." That's tough, bro. That's tough. That is amazing. That is that had no reason being as hard as it was. <laughs> I'm like glad it's short, but I also like a part, an evil part of me wishes it was like a three minute song because I would want to hear with a second verse, <laughs> like about that. It just like he, she would surely be name drop. Like she would be like pajama jamming off the black. Uh, yeah, underground Atlanta, where you stay? Uh, it would be some crazy wicked shit. <laughs> that might be song of the year. That's fire. That is fire. <laughs> Next track is titled Demons and Angels. ATL Jacob, ATL Jacob, face that. The 30 second warmly outro is insane. I always I always I'm never usually a big fan of those personally. Willing in the maple, can't enable me. They try to betray me. They always hate me. They always play me. Can't relate to me. They always hate on me. Quick little freestyle. But uh the song was cool. Overall, the song was solid. Solid work. Uh again, not a fan of the 30 second outro. But that's just a little thing about me. It's like not a general thing. I just think that like if you're gonna do an outro that long, there's gotta be something new there, in my opinion. That's always just my opinion on things. But uh we're with that one, there's not really it's just the same chorus, just in a warbly effect. Which is cool. It's cool. I like topically what she talks about here. Melodically, she's pretty solid here as well. Um I don't know, it's just there's something that's just mi mi it's like missing that oomph to me. I can't exactly pinpoint what it is at the moment. I'll probably have to come back to it and listen to it. It's not a bad song. It just feels like it's lacking in, like, 
something. I want to say direction, but I'm not entirely sure. Next track is called Change the World. Oh, I hear strings. Is that her playing them? It might actually be her playing them. Holy shit. This beat is nasty, though. This is hard. I like this. It's like the great ancestors calling to me. They speak to me. What they saying, Rose? Let me know what they saying. Speak for the ancestors. Sing the ting. Sing the ting. Right, 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 right. Get to it, get to it. Right, right. Not prioritizing the bread, bro. Not, not prioritizing the bread. This shit touching my soul right now. She, she raps so she talks so fast. Yo, like, you know when you like when you like someone be upset and you know they're upset because they like they speed up the cadence of how they talk. Like, nah, it's cool, my nigga. Don't even don't even trip, bro. Nah, it's cool. I see I see how it is, bro. Don't even we good, bro. We good. No, 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 bro. Don't even don't even stress, bro. We good, we good, we good, we good, we good, we good, we good. Yeah, 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 straight. Yeah, no, 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 we good, we good. Like, like. I'll show you, you straight, my nigga. Like, like, like real shit, like real, like real shit. You know what I'm saying? Orange Grove Street. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Going crazy, nigga. Young boy better, nigga. You know what I'm saying? I'm not no bitch, nigga. You know what I'm saying? I'm just chilling, nigga. You know what I'm saying? Young boy better, nigga. That guitar is hot. That guitar is so hot. This is a great fusion of like hip rock, man. That one's hard. That's going on the playlist. That's hard. I like that one. I like that one a lot. Uh, the instrumental was really, really good. It reminded me like it was like a good blend of like rock and then like if you took like a rock instrumental and blended with like a SZA type of like Kill Bill type of drum type of shit, and then you like fuse that with like how she's rapping, which is really tight. The tightest flows I've heard so far. Um, great instrumental, great infectious choir. These interludes of you know are really, really cool. They add to the narrative of like you, you know what I'm saying. We could change the world if you would just be different, essentially. And you didn't put effort in me, and you didn't treat me right. You know what I'm saying? Why did you know what I'm saying? Why? Pretty much, you just you hoeing me right now. And then the interlude at the end, where she's just like, Nah, I see, how, I see, how. just be chilling. You know what I'm saying? You, you really, she should really, she really be because when, when they're artists, you know what I'm saying? They rap really fast. Where they they rap all the time. They talking 24 seven, like 27 seven eleven. You know what I'm saying? Double up in heaven. You know what I'm saying? They just be talking really fast when they're upset. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? We good. We good. We good. We good. All right, let me stop. <laughs> let me stop. The final track we listen to is titled. ATL Zoo. Uh, it's definitely a zoo down here. Shout out to 29 millions of the production. That's hard! Oh god! That's kind of wavy. <laughs> Ew, why'd she say hello? hello. I'm not mad at the bar, just the way she said it. Hello. We're gonna rewind it. She said, <laughs> I'll turn into a munch if she look at my cheek. Uh huh. <laughs> Eat it up, monkey. What are these bars? It's like, I hate that they're wor like, usually I'd be like, these bars are horrifically, like, they're, they're, they're ass. But she's delivering them in a way that's, like, clearly tongue-in-cheek, that they're amazing. That a little munchie. That's fire. That's Instagram caption worthy. That might go on the birthday post. I go, hold you. That rip is crazy, yo. Far Cry produced this, bro. Did, the, did fucking you know Miles low-key get some credits on this, bro? What is this? Zoo! It's Atlanta Zoo! Zoo! It's Atlanta Zoo, yay! 
got gorillas and the killers. <laughs> Next to the trappers at the racetrack, they be filler. Uh, uh. See, I'm tired of them niggas with them loud ass engines. I'm tired of take their wheels and they drop all their suspensions, nigga. That one was hard. I like that one actually, like a lot. Like unironically, I really actually like that one a lot. That's going on the play. Uh, really wavy, really fun, really light, really bouncy. Um. It has the heaviness of like a dark trap song, but it's the inflections and the personality that she's breathing into the song makes it really, really fun, um, really dynamic, and narratively, it's just really, it's really fun to listen to. So I like it a lot. It's going on the playlist for sure. I love it, love it. All right, that was Amber Your Rose. How am I feeling about her as an artist overall? There's a lot of great fundamental things here. I see lots of potential for. Um, a unique personality, definitely, uh, at the bare minimum. When, um, I feel like when she's having more fun, it's either when she has more fun or has more uh, of, like, a really direct topical force focus is when the song tends to be, like, better. Like, Demons and Angels is, was, was okay, even though it has a very good narratively, and she, she has a solid pen. And the bad guy was, you know, to me right now, not from off the top of my head, not really that memorable. GSU Hoes might be the greatest song dropped this year. You know what I'm saying? You know what I'm saying? Might be the greatest song in her discography. I'm just saying, you cannot show me a better song than GSU Hoes. Listen, listen to me. Listen to me when I tell you that she said they're they're selling see at the racetrack. I be getting stoned eating pizza on the way back. Where else are you going to hear bars like that? You're not going to hear it. You're a liar. If you just, Where do you hear it? You're lying. Drake could never. But that was clearly a fun cut, just like uh, ATL Zoo. Really fun cut. Uh, and then Change the World, which is, again, a serious, serious note. Um, but the drums, the production, I really just drew something out of her really well that felt very intimate. Uh... And not as hook heavy, whereas Demons and Angels felt very hook heavy. And more lenient on that instead of like the overall arcing narrative of the entire thing. So, um, yeah, I think there's a lot of strong points. I think if you just, if she were to stay more on the path of like the topical for focus or really go lean into her personality, lean into her infle inflections, lean into um, when she's really just having fun and showcasing the per the personality and playing with inflections. I can say hi, hi. I can sing it low, low. I think that really works in her favor. It makes her uh, dynamic. It makes her more eclectic, on more um, sought after by more viewership because of the fact that she will do more, do more things. I also need the solo, man. I need the, I need the solo. I need the, I need the, I need the, I need the viola or violin solo. I'm, pretty, I'm forgetting which one it is off the top of my head, but she's really good at it. She needs to put that in the song. Trust me, I'm saying that, and I'm a tuba player. The tuba will go in a song. Trust and believe that will happen before I die. Overall, though, lots of fundamentally great things. I look forward to hearing more from her. She's released a few albums. If you guys want me to review any of those albums, let me know which one specifically in the comments below. Uh, yeah, um, I'm feeling a strong 6 to a light 7 out of this one. If you guys want to check out any of the songs uh, that you um, heard in this video, I recommend GSU Hoes. Because, again, like I said, it's the greatest song. It's my birthday anthem. It's going to be my birthday. It's going to be my my notes later. If you think I'm kidding, it's going to be my birthday anthem. Uh, GSU Hoes, bro. Because... Cause, cause why not? Cause I'm going down there. Be sure to like, comment, and subscribe, and share these videos. Cause more eyes on these videos means more eyes on the artists. Um, you guys have been supporting the channel really great. Thank you guys so much. Um, you know, what I'm saying the birthday video. I might do another video. Honestly, uh, kind of just a sit down conversation. It's gonna be re released probably later today. Um, but yeah, yeah, you guys you made it to 19 and another review down. Another great CE reviewed. Another, another, another musician on the map. Today's artist of the day was Amber Your Rose. Links all down below to her stuff. Be sure to go follow her, go support her. She's awesome people. Like, comment, subscribe. Stream not a word. Let's get that to a thousand, please. Uh, stay safe. Take care. I love y'all. Bye-bye.